everybody and welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be doing a video on the Yankee Candle friends and family haul um, this past Thursday and Friday were the was the friends and family sale and I actually went um, earlier in the week with my mom we were gonna go shopping and at Yankee at the outlet and I realized that um, when I got to the checkout line the manager who kind of knows me said, um, are you sure you don't want to wait until friends and family on, on Thursday or Friday? And I was just like, oh my gosh, I completely forgot. So if you guys aren't familiar, usually with friends, um, family and friends, you know, the sale, usually it's six for 60, meaning any six jars, like large jars for $60, so 10 bucks a piece. But now they changed it. It was, the deal was, um, you know, I think it was $14, $13.99 for any large jar, plus you got 30% off of that, which brought the total down to like $9.80 a jar. So um, it was a little bit cheaper, you know, it, it worked out, it was okay. So let me just show you what I got. The first thing is an accessory, and this is the only accessory I got. I got a shade, and this one has snowmen, and trees, pine trees, birch trees. Um, there's a little bird in here somewhere. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. But this one's really cute. And this basically I will show you um, on a different candle that I have here. Oh my gosh, this one's peppermint cocoa. But anyway, um, it just basically fits on top. And you can also get a plate but I already previously had a plate, so I didn't need one. But that's, you know, kind of what it looks like. Really, really cute and pretty. Um, I did actually talk with one of my Yankee Candle friends, and they said be very, very careful with a clear or white type of shade because of the fact that the soot will get all up in here. And I wasn't thinking at the time. So I'm just gonna use this as a decor piece and um, not put it on when I'm burning. So let's get into the candles that I got. I didn't get too many, didn't go overboard. The first one that I got was a Pure Radiance uh, Yankee Candle. And this one is uh, one of their crackling ones. And it is in Merry Mint. And it is, um, you know, mint color and it smells just like a peppermint patty like a york peppermint patty oh it smells so good and there's the wick and i've never had a wood burning wick from yankee so um i've heard mixed reviews i've heard that it burns excellent i've heard that it tunnels really bad so we will see but i really love the glass jar in this if anything you know i'll still have the glass jar and now let me get into my big candles that I got. The first one I got was Frosted Cedar Wreath. And my mom actually was the one who found this candle and picked it out. I love this candle. Um, you know, the first thing you think of when you look at the label, you think, oh, it's going to smell like pine, which it smells like a different pine. It smells like berries and pine mixed with peppermint. It has a very icy, icy, um, you know, smell to it. It is in the festive line and I cannot wait. This one again is the two wick. And I'm really excited about this one. I've got like hair or something on me. I don't know what it is. Okay. And then the next one I got was Snowberry. And this is also another one that I've been looking for. This one is in the festive line again. And this one just smells like snowberries. Like it has a berry scent to it, but it also has a winter scent to it, if that makes sense. It just smells really, really good. I will get the description, um, you know, up when I review these candles. So make sure and keep on watching my channel because I will be doing a review on the burn and scent throw and everything for each one of these. And then the next one that I got, and this is a Country Kitchen uh, label jar. This one is in Cherry Ice. And I love cherries on snow, but they did not have it, which I already have one anyway. So I thought that I would get a Cherry Ice. And this one, I love cherries 
on snow and this one smells so much like it it's like cherries but frosted oh it smells so good so love this one and it's red so very festive and then the next one that I got is Lakeside Birch and I know a lot of people when I posted this on Facebook everybody's like oh good luck with that one oh we don't like that one or whatever I think there was only one person who said that they liked it and I like it it's in the fresh collection and it has okay it smells like kind of like a perfumey perfume and cologne mixed together but it's softened like powder, like baby powder and outdoorsy scents. I don't know. It's really good, but it could just be because I live in Wisconsin and I'm used to these smells a lot. I mean, we're outdoors all the time here. And, um, you know, I mean, just down the street is a family of deer from me. So, you know, we're very woodsy, I guess, here. So that's kind of why you know, I don't have a problem with it. I really love it. I'm hoping that the scent throw is good on this one. I heard that it wasn't, so we'll have to wait and see. And then the last candle that I picked up, and please excuse the way I pronounce this, Chimpaca Blossom. This is a new one in their, um, spring line that's going to come out. I picked this up at the outlet. I was so excited that they had it. And it is a light peach, you know, color candle, really pretty. And it's got a picture of, I'm guessing that that's the flower that it is on the front. It has the new label here. And it smells of a beautiful, delicate flower like that you would find in Hawaii. Very, very nice. Not really an overwhelming strong scent, but it's just strong enough, you know, that it's enough. Smells really, really good. So that was my Yankee Hall friends and family. I'm so glad that you guys joined me today. Uh, if you have any of these candles, please leave comments down below and let me know what you think of them. Um, and then also, please don't forget to subscribe. Again, all of these candles I'm going to be reviewing in a separate video. So stay tuned for that. And don't forget to thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye-bye.